We are going to be making brownie turkeys. What's up guys, it's Connor Minix back with another video and today I'm here with my grandma. Hi everyone. And today we are going to be making brownie turkeys. This is just a good Thanksgiving dessert. Kids will enjoy mm -hmm. it. Just mm -hmm. something easy for Thanksgiving and it takes a little amount of time and very simple. Before we start this video, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe. Okay, let's get started. Okay, you want to start out making a brownie mix. So, you just follow the directions on the box. You can make them homemade, but these are just so easy and quick and cheap. I got this box for a dollar. Then, you want to Line a 9 by 13 pan with foil and spray it so they don't stick. Put the brownie mix in. You put it in the oven. Bake it at 350. While the brownies are baking, we're going to go ahead and make the frosting. So you want, you need a stick of butter, softened, and two-thirds cup of cocoa powder. So we're mixing the butter and the cocoa powder together. Then we're going to slowly add some powdered sugar. Slow. Alternate, alternating with the milk. A little bit. And mix. So we have three cups of powdered sugar all together. I forgot to tell you, it's three cups of powdered sugar and a third cup of milk. And so you just add a little bit of that. And then we're going to finish off with the rest of our powdered sugar in her milk and a teaspoon of vanilla and we're going to mix that on medium looks pretty good so we took the brownies out about two to three minutes early so we, they don't get too hard so i'm going to put the frosting in the pampered chef decorator you could just use a plastic baggie and cut the corner. They're pulling there nicely. <laughs> so we're going to get them out of the pan. They'll cool even faster. We're going to use a biscuit cutter and make the brownies into circles. <laughs> you could just use a glass if you don't have a cutter. We're going to put them on the cooling rack to cool. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is a sample of what we're trying to do here. So you just want to kind of swirl the frosting on. We have the bigger candy corn, so we're only going to put four pieces. If you have the small, you could put six. And then we'll put the edible eyes on. So tiny, can't pick them up. And then we trim down our candy corn a little bit for the nose. Keep doing it. Here's the finished product, and they were so easy. The kids will enjoy them. Okay, guys, we're back, and the brownies are done. They turned out really good, and they were so easy. They didn't take us a lot of time at all, and they would be great at your Thanksgiving party or wherever you'll take them. Should we try one? Sure. I think. Pretty good. If you guys have any more ideas for Thanksgiving recipes you want to see, make sure you leave a comment telling us what to make. We have a lot of great videos planned out for Thanksgiving and Christmas with all kinds of special guests. So make sure you stay tuned for those. 
Okay guys, thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed this Thanksgiving video. If you want to see more videos, make sure you leave a like and also hit the subscribe button. And then click the notification bell so you'll be notified every time we upload a new video. And also check the links in the description to all of our social medias. For Thanksgiving and Christmas, we're going to be doing some giveaways. Giving away some of Grandma's best treats like Butterfingers, Fudge, and a ton of other stuff. So thank you for watching, and we'll see you guys later. Ready? One, two, three. Bye. Bye.